U.S. warns China for lethal aid to Russia. U.S. National Security Advisor Jake Sullivan has affirmed that China would pay real costs if it moved towards providing lethal aid that would help Russia in the Russia-Ukraine war. The statement by the U.S. White House Security Advisor was made during an interview with CNN's State of the Union program on Sunday at a critical juncture in the war in Ukraine. Notably, the Chinese envoy visited Russia to show its support. From our perspective, actually, this war presents real complications for Beijing, and Beijing will have to make its own decisions about how it proceeds, whether it provides military assistance. But if it goes down that road, it will come at real costs to China, and I think China's leaders are weighing that as they make their decisions," said the U.S. National Security Advisor. Jake Sullivan warns China over its support to Russia. The U.S. has not just threatened China, but they have laid out both the stakes and the consequences of how things would turn out," said Sullivan in his diplomatic conversation with China. Further, he added, "And we are doing that clearly and specifically behind closed doors. Since the Russian invasion of Ukraine, Russia has asked for drones and ammunition from China, shared a source familiar with the input. However." Chinese President Xi Jinping has been discussing whether to send lethal aid or not for the past several months. Meanwhile, the White House has intelligence input that China has been considering Russia to provide arms, ammunition, and drones that could help the Russian invasion of Ukraine, said three sources familiar with the intelligence told CNN. However, it appears that China has not made its final decision because the negotiations between Russia and China about the price and scope of the equipment are ongoing. CIA Director William Burns also shared his concerns about China's lethal aid to Russia. We are confident that the Chinese leadership is considering the provision of lethal equipment," said Burns. Further, he said that they also don't see that a final has been made yet. And they have not witnessed an actual shipment of lethal equipment.